A beautiful day to organize an outdoor picnic. <laughs> the dishes are fully and carefully prepared. Bonbon bon couldn't resist and ate a large piece of chicken thigh. The last chicken thigh but no one was willing to give it up. An uninvited guest suddenly appeared. Suddenly Ban Ban and Jumbo Josh discovered something unusual. Oh no, a pile of bird not only eats food but now also bullies you. Ban Ban uses a racket to catch the pile of bird. Pile bird unexpectedly turned out to be very cunning and stood high up, and the bonbon could not catch it. Go, go, go! The combination of the two people still could not catch the pile of bird. Not only that, but they were also counter damaged. What did Bon Bon and Jumbo just plan to punish Joe Pile Bird? Oh. Ban Ban came up with the idea of making wings to fly. Now it's time to test the manufactured product. Oh no, the wings were torn and caused Ban Ban to fall. This method doesn't work. Jumbo Josh thought of another way. What a beautiful day to attend a picnic. Oh. What is Sheriff Toadster planning? Why is his face so deceitful? Oh my god! The chili is added to the sandwich! Hey! Jumbo Josh received the food without knowing that the cake had chili added to it. Oh no! The chili has burst with spiciness! <laughs> Sheriff Toadster continues to tease you! Jumbo Josh is still honest and innocent. Lips are swollen because of eating too much spicy food. Jumbo Josh is feeling hot and swollen. Sheriff Toadster helps Jumbo Josh check. What? Ice is working. Don't worry! <gasps> because it's too spicy, I get a fever. Huh? <laughs> Mouth sores are stirring in Jumbo Josh's oral cavity. <laughs> huh? Ice that turns into coach huh? pickles to fight the heat of mouth heat is Ban Balin Na. <laughs> this match seems to be unequal. Hmm? <laughs> oh my gosh! Hmm? <sighs> huh? <laughs> Finally, there is a solution. Oh no, still not fully resolved. Haha, Ban Balima's attack no longer works. Oh. Hmm. The battle with heat is over. 
Oh. <laughs> oh. Huh? Eating too spicy makes Jimbo Josh's lips dry and cracked. Let's use some lip balm. Great, everything is back to normal. <gasps> I'm sorry. <laughs> what is Bambolina snooping on? <laughs> Today's Bon Bon Moon is very happy, dancing and singing at the same time. Really love life. Yeah. Oh my god. Bambolina broke into Bon Bon's house while he was away. In the house, there are two sleeping fists. Bambolina sly smile. The mushrooms are startled to see Bambolina in the house. Looking at Bambolina's actions, can you guess what she intends to do? The small mushroom explained to Bambolina why mushrooms should not be eaten, because they were still growing and giving birth to young mushrooms. The old mushroom panicked and got angry. It explained but Bambolina still decided to eat it. Right after taking the first bite of the mushroom, Bambolina's stomach had problems. Oh my god! Oh no! After learning she couldn't eat the old mushroom, Bambolina turned to the young mushroom, intending to eat it. Bambolina was angry because she didn't know which mushroom to eat. And then, a dangerous smile appeared on her lips. Oh my god! When she heard someone's footsteps entering the house, hey. Bambolina panicked and dressed up as a mushroom. <laughs> Bambolina shivered, afraid of being discovered by Bon Bon. The little mushroom tells Bon Bon everything. Bon Bon transforms into a bowl of water. Ha ha, both mushrooms after drinking water urinated on Bambolina. Bambolina was exposed, trying to run away but was stopped by Bon Bon. She fell to the floor, broke all her teeth. Oh my god! After examining his teeth, Bon Bon asks Nabna and Slow Selena for help. <laughs> Nab Nab and Slow Selena combine tweezers to work. Bon Bon fitted a new set of dentures for Ben Bolina. Blue is smiling happily on the green grass. He took out a box of clay to play with. Knead the clay really well. Then they will shape the clay together. Tada! Turns out who made Jumbo Josh so cute. Blue looks very interested in his product. Suddenly a frog appeared rushing up from the bottom of the pond. Blue screams in panic because he is afraid of frogs. Luckily it jumped back into the pond. There's something in the grass. It turned out to be an island covered in soil. At the same time, Ban Ban was whistling approaching. Ban Ban saw Blue and immediately laughed and tried to troll something. 
Lulu started to wipe the dirt on the stone. <gasps> what? Uh, oh no, Bad Band uh, Band stole it. <laughs> Lulu is very angry and chases after to get the item. Oh my god. Blue tripped and fell full of injuries. Ban Ban didn't help you but also gave a mocking hey. laugh to Blue. He also trolls Blue. Blue sighs helplessly because of Ban Ban's wit. He didn't hesitate to throw the stone straight into the pond and tease Blue. Blue fell to the ground crying sadly. Ooh. <laughs> wow! The beautiful stone automatically floats to the surface of the water. Blue thinks he has to hide the stone and jump o Josh to avoid the bad guy taking it. Blue started to add the edge of the rock to the body of the clay, then mold it again to make it beautiful. Oh my god! It starts to move. Jumbo Josh looks like he has a human heart. Hello. <laughs> Two friends having fun getting to know each other. The two of you went to the park and met Ban Ban there. Okay. Blue asks Jumbo Josh to duel with Ban Ban. Ha ha. In just a minute, Jumbo has defeated the opponent. Revenge for Blue. Bambolino was walking down the street when suddenly the phone rang. Nab Nab slyly looked at Bambolino. What was he up to? Oh no, Nab Nab snatched Bambolino's bag, causing her to fall to the ground. Bambolino was angry. She hurriedly threw her phone at Nab Nab to prevent him from escaping. After being hit, Nab Nab got angry. He bit Bambolina's hand. And then, the two of them got into a fight. After the battle, Nab Nab paid for his actions as he lost all his teeth. Bambolina went to see a doctor for treatment. Let's see how the doctor will help Bambolina. Oh my god! Oh! The doctor took out some necessary tools to clean Bambolina's wound. Ah! Near the wound, there is a swarm of bacteria attacking the bleeding area. These bacteria are stubborn. <laughs> Eventually these bacteria also disappeared. This makes it more convenient to treat the wound. The wound has been cured. Bambolina Thank thanked you. the doctor and left. Bye bye! <gasps> hey. At the same time, Nab Nab ran in with his mouth and cried for help. What happened? Oh my god! The doctor took out a microscope to see the condition of Nab Nab's teeth. The doctor uh -huh. thought for a moment and then took out a new set of teeth for Nab Nab. Nab Nab is happy to see the new set of teeth. Thank you. Nab Nab thanked the doctor and left. But to his surprise, he met Bambolina again, whom he'd bitten. Stop! The doctor explained to Nab Nab his wrong actions. Sorry. Okay. <laughs> <laughs>
<laughs> oh! Bonbon bon is so professional at roller skating. What are you planning? <laughs> Apply glue to the chair? <laughs> Who is he trying to troll? <laughs> oh! The bad guy is here. <laughs> Chef Pigster doesn't care about the glue chair. He only cares about the food. <gasps> oh my god! Bon Bon briefly stole Chef Pigster's food. Huh? <laughs> Chef Pigster is angry but can't do anything because his butt is stuck to the chair. Bon Bon yanked the chair away, causing Chef Pigster to fall and hit his face on the ground. The chair shattered. Oh. Huh? Let's go treat the wound. Sorry. Huh? Oh my god! Applying ice directly to the buttocks surprised Jeff because it was too cold. Oh no the glue is too tight! Just have to find a way to get it out! My butt is all red. I need to disinfect it right away. Apply a lotion to soothe the wound. Huh? Oh. <laughs> Chef Pigster is too angry to find a way to troll Bon Bon. Huh? Bon Bon is playful, huh? so he won Jeff's plan. <laughs> Chef enjoys trolling Bon Bon again. Huh? <laughs> What's happened? Bam Bam Lena has to run away from these two right now. Both of them have something wrong with them but still try to act like they're victims. Stop! Bambolina clearly explains that both of their actions are wrong. The two realize their mistake and shook hands and apologized to each other. Let's always be good friends. Bon Bon is happily playing with the doll. Wow! Hello! Wow! Bon Bon doesn't want to have pigs too near his doll. Okay! Huh? Bon Bon immediately put the doll in his closet to avoid others touching it. Bon Bon had fun playing on the seesaw with Jumbo Josh. <laughs> Chef Pigster sees an opportunity so he steals Bon Bon's doll. Oh my gosh! But unfortunately Chef Pigster tripped and broke Bon Bon's doll. Bon Bon did not see his doll and immediately told Jumpo Josh a previous incident. No. Huh? Chef Pig's too plotting to blame Jumpo. This baby is so naughty. It's really annoying that Bon Bon misunderstood Jumpo Josh. Now Jumbo has to endure Chef Pigster's wrongdoings.
clean all stains on the doll. Then use glue to reattach the doll's head. Spray the paint on the doll again. Now the doll is like new again. I wish I could fix it as skillfully as you. Bonbon <laughs> bon didn't know anything so he still had fun playing with Chef Pigster. Huh? Jumbo brought the repaired doll to Bonbon. Bon. Bambolina explains and tells the truth to Bon Bon. Bon Bon understood and scolded Chef Pigster. Happy friends are back together. <laughs> Chef Pigster was walking around when he suddenly saw a pizza cart. Here is your favorite dish. Nab Nab is baking pizza. This one must be great. Wow! <laughs> wow! <laughs> the beautiful Bambolina walked up and caught Nab Nab's attention with her beauty. <laughs> Chef Pigster is upset when Nab Nab okay. doesn't focus on selling but keeps good. <laughs> After arguing for a while, the two of them spilled the pizza on the street. Bambolino was very upset about that. Nab Nab was angry, causing Chef to run away in panic. Well, if I can't buy pizza, I'll make my own pizza at home. Looking at this scene, I remember the memory of my mother and I making pizza together. Mom prepares the ingredients for me and I go online to look at the instructions and follow them. Both were very happy that day. The taste of the cake when eaten is also very delicious. Having poured the flour and spices into the bowl, I will now mix the ingredients together. The cake base has been completed. Now I will make the toppings for the cake. There will be sausages, vegetables, and ketchup with more flavor. Yeah to my favorite part, let's decorate the pizza toppings. Can't forget string cheese. Just bake a cake. The scent is really attractive. If I'm there, I'll ask Pigster for two pieces of cake. It's hot so eat it right away. Wow! After eating, I have muscles. Too awesome! 
<laughs> Nab Nab is intrigued by this delicious cake. Bye. It turned out that Pigster also opened a pizza truck, which made Nab Nab jealous. Nab Nab bought the cake to taste to taste good. <laughs> wow! <gasps> what? Oh my god! Obviously Nab Nab paid in advance. <laughs> Chef trying to teach Nab Nab a lesson? Chef used a punch line that scared Nab Nab and ran away. Wow, Ban Balina and Chef Pigster in the ripe fruit picking garden. Oh no, Chef Pigster refused to pick the basket and instead ate it all. This is so annoying. Suddenly, strange fruit fell from above and hit Jeff Pigster's head. Huh? <laughs> this strange fruit looks delicious. Wow! <laughs> Chef Pigster suddenly came up with a new idea. What happened? Ben Balina <laughs> saw Jeff Pigster doing something no, strange. No. Ben Balina advises against eating strange fruit. Huh? Huh? Chef Pigster still insisted on eating it because it was really delicious. <laughs> A foul smell came out, making Ben Balina feel very uncomfortable. Huh? Chef Pigster's stomach began to feel unstable and continuously deflated. Chef Pigster recounted the story of eating a strange fruit that gave him a stomach ache to the doctor. Oh my god! Wow! <sighs> oh no, the stomach ache is still making Jeff Pigster very uncomfortable. Chef Pigster was put to bed for an ultrasound to see what was happening in his stomach. Constant bloating in the stomach. Help me! Help me! Oh! <laughs> the doctor gave Chef Pigster digestive medicine. Coach Pickles is a digestive medicine that helps Chef Pigster's stomach get better. Wow! The cured <laughs> Chef Pigster feels comfortable and at ease. Thank you. <laughs> the doctor advised uh, Chef Pigster not to eat strange okay. fruits without knowing it because it will cause unnecessary consequences. Hello. Chef Pigster explains that he is completely recovered. There still seems to be some doubt. Huh? Oh my god! Huh? Oh! Ha ha! Silent Steve was thrown a strange fruit by Chef Pigster while trying to threaten everyone, and the result is also flatulence and bloating. Ha ha ha!